Every crisis uh, brings the hope of, of some radical change. I mean, we, we know that from looking at the past. A lot of the welfare programs in the world, the social safety nets, came out of the experiences of World War I or World War II. Um, and I, I hope that the post-COVID world is a lot more humane. It would be a lot more humanitarian as well, of course, but more humane. In the United States, we put so little of our resources into protecting children, into universal education, into daycare, into social safety nets, unemployment insurance, national health insurance. You know, we have so many resources in the United States, but if we want to understand why we did uniquely poorly, we had better start rethinking our safety nets. And I think that's happening right now in the United States. And I look and read about it happening in Latin America, in Europe, in Africa. Asia really had some more established social protection programs, perhaps, in some parts of the world, but it's happening there as well. So I think for a lot of us, having endured a very, very long winter that stretched out over two years, you know, we see a more humane society or inter interlocking societies coming out of this. That, that's the hope of many progressive uh, certainly in my field of uh, global health, nurses, doctors, all the folks that work in healthcare delivery, this is what we're hoping, is that we're going to come out of this more humane than we were before.